All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. Hello, <laughs> you came around the corner like that. What's your name? <laughs> My name's Tamarcus. And how old are you? I'm 37. And what do you do? I am a crane operator. Oh, okay, very nice. Yeah, and I also stream on Twitch. Oh, okay. So what are some things you like to do for fun? I'm a, I like to work out uh, for fun. I'm a, a outside guy, I like to go hiking. Okay, got that type it. Of stuff. Okay, so what are some things you look for in a woman? Communication. Uh, someone who can talk, someone who uh, expresses themselves. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, pretty much. Okay. Communication. Got it. Now, what are some deal breakers? Deal breakers. Uh, a cigarette smoker. Cigarette smokers. Mm -hmm. I don't, I can't do cigarette smoking. Okay. 420 is cool, but cigarette smoking, not. So, no. Okay. Got it. All right, so we did get some pop balloons. Let's right. go on over there and see why they ended up popping. We can have your name and age. I'm Kila. Hey, we back with another reaction. Man, y'all know how I do. Put your cash up in the comment. Also, if y'all want to join the $1,000 giveaway, all you got to do is subscribe to the channel. Go follow me on Instagram at 200 underscore acre short and the giveaway. We'll be doing the giveaway live on this channel October 22nd. You don't want to miss it. You feel me? But hey, I ain't going to hold y'all for too long. But I'm going to tell y'all this. She rejected him, but I don't think he cared too much. Because look, you going, you going straight to the house. <laughs> Where we going on the first date? Or that, that's exactly what the answer would be. To the house. <laughs> With that on, to the crib. We ain't going to a restaurant. I hope you don't think that. We going to the house. You hear me? Hey, look at the video, fam. 26. <clears throat> Kila, why did you pop your balloon? <clears throat> Just the age, you know, um, and the piercing, too. I'm really not a fan of the, the I don't know what it's, yeah, yeah. I'm just not a fan of it. Right. Yeah. He got a piercing. Where the All piercing right, at? Because y'all know how. Bro, come on now. We don't do that around here. 30 something. Nah, we don't wear septum stuff. If you wear a septum around me, you ain't hanging around me, bro. Like, that's a sign of weirdness. If I see somebody with that on, I'm like, uh, yeah. You already excommunicado. You hear me? Take take that off, bro. Like, we don't do that. Uh, is Keela someone that's your type? <clears throat> uh, not off of physical attraction. Like, I feel like this right here is like a physical attraction thing right here because mm -hmm. I really don't know what she's about yet exactly. but physically no okay and why not uh just not my just not my type mm -hmm. i feel like the jeans might be showing a little too much like if we're looking for love type you feel what me? i say okay. Okay. what i say we going to the crib <laughs> ladies if y'all watching this just know that if you just trying to go to the crib where that that's all I'm trying to say, but don't wear that and expect to be treated like a queen. Queens get queen treatment. You feel me? When you dress like that, you get that treatment. You feel me? I swear. All right. Let's go over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Shiloh, 27. Hey. I pop oh. <laughs> and Shiloh, why did you end up popping your balloon? It's the hat. You look like off them on the block. And I was <laughs> like, who? Like uncles, like uncle, on the block, on like the, the uncle name on the block, uncle like on the block. trying to pick up the young thing. Right. Yeah, I wasn't feeling it. Right. Yeah. I feel it. <laughs> GG's chill. I feel it. It was like, it was giving like my uncle, you know, like, ugh. Right, right, right. Yeah. It was just, that, that, that was just, that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uncle on the block, so, I like that. He right, do kind of, you feel me? So she's someone that's your type? He do kind of uh, got that I old would, man type swag, you feel me? One of them OGs in the hood on the block type. For real, he do kind of got that swag. But on the other hand, she ain't nothing but a floozy. I seen her Instagram on MTR page. I don't know how he be finding them, but I seen it. And the way she was looking, she looked like a a, 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 a clap fest. You feel me? Definitely I ain't going to pop yeah, I would approach. I would approach. And we got one more pop balloon. Your name and age. Hi, I'm Mercedes. I'm 27. And, and Mercedes, why did you end up popping your balloon? Just the age. Okay. Yeah. Got it. How old are you? 27. 27. And you're? I'm 37. 37, okay. Got it. And now, is she someone that's your type? I probably wouldn't know. No, no, no. Okay. Not, and why not? Not physically not? attracted. Not physically attracted. Okay. 
Okay. That's it. <laughs> Physically attractive. Thank you. <laughs> Let's head on back. So we do have three balloons left unpopped. Go ahead and ask these remaining ladies a question to see who's more of your match. Uh, let me hear. Okay. Let me hear something that you took from your past relationships to uh, further, you know, for the for the future relationship. Something that was negative that in your past relationship, you know what I'm saying? Like toxic, toxic traits. A toxic trait from your last relationship, past relationships. So what's a toxic trait they had in, they their, past had in their past relationship? Okay, okay. That was brought to your attention. Mm, oh, those, that the partner brought up to them right, that they had. Right. Oh, I see. Okay. Let's start here. <laughs> Name and age and the toxic trait. Hi, I'm Angelique. I'm 32. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um... <laughs> Okay, uh, I can be a little tough, and I can show, I show a lot of tough love, unfortunately, and I can be a little more masculine than most people would like, and I know where it stemmed from. Yeah, I went through therapy about it, but I didn't realize it was still showing up until he brought it up to me, and I think once he let me know that it's okay to put the wall down and not be that way, like therapy is one thing, but to practice what you're learning in therapy is something completely different. Right. And I think once he brought that up to me, I was able to just like exhale, let go, and I can um, rest in my feminine energy. It's actually right. very beautiful. Yeah. We well, I'm telling I'm finna just take a month off of YouTube, bro. Like, I'm, I'm she alone just pissed me off. I'll be mad for no reason thinking about these folks, man. When, I, when I'm when i not even on YouTube, it's affecting my life. So now you need somebody to teach you how to be a woman? Now I can rest in my femininity after I went to cancel. You need canceling to teach you how... You know a woman is naturally feminine. You need a... You need somebody to teach you how to be a woman. That's what's wrong with these people. I can rest in my femininity. What? But what's wrong with y'all, bro? What's y'all issue? Seriously. Seriously. What's wrong with y'all? Y'all need, bro. Y'all need prayer. that line but it's actually a real thing so right, right, right. that's it for me all right okay. let's go down over there all right your name and age and what is a toxic trait that was brought up to you from your past partners <laughs> tyra 31 um a toxic trait that i was told about would be she's a skeezer too i seen her in the club licking cake off somebody's finger on MTR channel, like I say, he be finding them. I don't know how he found them Instagrams. Y'all gotta go ask MTR. I don't know, but y'all go to his channel. Y'all see it? She was licking. For, I'm like, what? You don't even got have the room to say a judgment. You know, I'm not gonna say. No, I'm sorry. I didn't even hear what she got to say, but I just had to tell y'all that. <sighs> More so, like thinking before I speak. Um, sometimes I just, oh, and it just comes right out. Um, and just knowing when to say things and like when to maybe wait or let your feelings catch up and then right. say it at a different time. Right. But I do have one request. I do apologize. Um, can you take off the hat? I can, yes. Okay, thank you. Yes, I appreciate yes, that. <laughs> appreciate that. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I was like, what is underneath yes, that? Yes, ma'am. No, you, yes, ma'am. I am bald headed. Nothing. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, nothing. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let's go on to our next lady. <laughs> your name and age, and what is a toxic trait you were told about from your past partners? Uh, my name is Shannon, 27. Um, I can answer your question, but I was, I'm going to pop. Oh, okay. So, All right. Why do we end up popping? Um, just the age. I think 37. I'm 27. Right. 10 was right at my limit, but I would want, um, if he's going to be... 27. You look 37. You look 37. There's no way you're 27. Black don't crack, but it's cracking on her. You feel me? But I ain't gonna lie. She ain't, I, I'm not finna get on her and say she ugly. I'm just saying she look 37. She not ugly. She decent, but she look 37. You feel what I'm saying?
It looked like that could be a good match. Right at 37, I think there's a couple different characteristics I was looking for, so. Right. Like what? Um, not gaming and twitching. That was, that was like, I mean, I like to game, right. but I'm also 27. But, and I was like, if I wanted my 37 year old not to game as much as a big hobby of his, but that's all. Otherwise right. you do look good. I appreciate okay. it. Yeah. So now, is she someone that's your type? Uh, I would say she's cool. Like I wouldn't like necessarily like approach her on like a relationship type level, but mm -hmm. I would definitely like try to figure out a little bit more. Mm. That's my problem. I got a lot of guy friends. I don't know. Nobody <laughs> wants to be with me. I don't know. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. Why did we end up popping? Um, I wanted to hear you out. The baldness doesn't bother me. The nose piercings a little throw me off. Um, you just don't seem like my type. Right. You coming in with the side hat, I get the vibe that she was getting, but I'm just right. like, I wouldn't holla at you if I seen you. So right. it's just. Yeah, you got to keep it, yeah. keep it a hundred. Yeah. Keep it a book. For sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Now, is she someone that's your type? I would probably definitely, yeah, I would probably talk to her. I would probably talk to her. Yeah, thank you. Try to thank you. a little bit more. <laughs> All right. We've got our lone balloon over here. Any questions between the two of you? Mm. No. No questions. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You look like you're getting ready to pop. I think I am. Okay. I'm sorry. No, you're you're All good. right, so why do we pop? Honestly, I think, um, okay, you know what? I'm gonna just say it, okay. I know that I might be your type, probably. And I know that because of the way that you were looking at me. Right. Like, you know, you could, Eat me up on this. I just can't take it no more, bro. I can't take her no more, bro. Like, who gas? It's y'all. It's y'all fault, Simps. Y'all gas her head up. Y'all did that. How you gonna fault him? For looking at a woman that he's attracted to on a dating show. What you expect for him to do? Oh, you looking at me like you want I know you're attracted. You're on a dating show. What is that? Floor. And, right. you know, I think when I'm initially meeting someone, especially when there's a thousand different beautiful women standing here, right. it's uncomfortable right. to constantly look at, look, be looked at like right. they want to eat you up right. in that moment. Like, you know, granted, love it. Yes. Let right. my man look at me like that. But right here, right now, it is so uncomfortable. Right. You know, right. I, I can't see. And I think I get that. I get that all the time at work. And I just be like, all right, bro. Like, I'm just trying to be look at Arlette face, bro. Look at the shit. It says it all. <laughs> says it all, bro. You saying a bunch of BS. Oh, I like it, but I can't stand. You're on a dating show, bro. You're not at work. She got that, uh, that complex that everybody likes me complex. First of all, she's not even my type, by the way. But she got that complex that everybody likes her. You feel what I'm saying? She got that because Simps. Simps then gave it to her. You feel what I'm saying? And I'm like, she's not even all that to me. I swear she not. She really not. But for you to sit up here and fault someone on a dating show who sees somebody they're attracted to, and you say, I can't stand it. And then go say, granted, I like it for my man to look like, well, what is you talking about? Like, come on, bro. Be here. So you don't so, you don't think that it's like the, I think the it male just, like that's really feeling you? You don't think that's No, like, I feel that. That's why I said I, I know for a right. fact that I'm your type. It's just it makes me so uncomfortable right now. Right. And that's why I was kind of like waiting. I'm like, damn, maybe I could just, I could chill. Right, Is right, he right, your right. type? You know, my friends are going to say I don't really have a type. Okay. So, eh. Everyone looks different. Love is love. You feel me? Right. So, there's that. All right. Well, then. <laughs> Unfortunately, that is all the balloons yes, popped. But yes, we do thank you so much for yeah, coming I you. on. I appreciate you. you guys are beautiful, too. Let's go I ahead appreciate. and give it up for him, ladies. Thank hey, you. Hey, don't ever, bro. This chick right here, don't bring her back on here, bro.
Bro, I'm telling you, I got PTSD, bro. Her and that chick in the green dress, I cannot forget them. They just be popping up in my dreams, just pop. Like, her, some just stupid just come in my mind for no reason now because I didn't listen to them. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real. Bro, if she wanted to go viral, I think she accomplished it. She went on there for cloud. I think she accomplished her goal. It may not be for the right reason. But, I mean, yeah. God, bro, I'm so happy I'm done with this sex series, bro. Lord have mercy, Jesus. Episode 25, I think I've accomplished. Wait, I think I probably got one more, but oh. Lord, you just don't know, bro. I'm just ready to... I got. I'm a, I might just do the other one tonight and get it over with, so I can just be completely finished with this. Cause this white dress, bro, I'm getting tired of her. Like I'm sick and tired of her. Like for real. I ain't even lying to y'all, man. But hey, thank you guys for watching the video. See you guys next video. Always remember, be safe out there, kings and queens. Let's keep.